Hey guys, let's get into this video. General Savage. Eddie, soldier. General Savage. Eddie, soldier. Hey guys, thank you so much for tuning back into my channel. My name is Beauty Fat and we're about to review Otre's Allegra wig. Okay, so here's the stock card. It says that it is a lace front wig with a five inch parting. It does say that you can use um, a curling iron, but I mean, or a flat iron, but I would not do that. The back of it just has some informational stuff on how to care for it and step-by-step -step instructions on how to apply it. So here it is straight out of the net. And it really is a good quality wig. Like it does not feel like the average synthetic hair. It reminds me of the texture of um, Sensational's Audrey wig. Here is the lace. Um, it's pretty long. That looks good. It looks really natural. It's not too tight, um, not too wide. I'm kind of excited about it. It has your standard comb in the back, adjustable straps, and then your standard combs on each side, and here is the lace. All right, so let's pop this baby on and see what we're working with. The model on the stock card has the part in the middle, so I'm going to try to um, line the combs up with the way the manufacturer intended for me to style it. So let's see how that works out. Um, first look, I'm not liking that middle part at all. <laughs> so you'll see me fooling around with it a couple of times until I figure out how it's, how I feel it looks good on me. Like, I like that right there. I'm just trying to understand why such a high low, high left, low right. And then two, um, after a second, you'll see how it appears one side is longer than the other. Now that General looks good. Savage. I don't know why I didn't Eddie like that because that him. actually looked really good. At one point in time, I remember thinking, I need to cut it a little bit. And then I was like, no, you start cutting on it, it'll never be the same. And then at another point, I remember thinking, something is off. Like, something about this is, it's just not cut right, styled right, curled right, or something. I just couldn't figure it out. <laughs> That's what made me pick up the stock card. I was like, what is going on? Like, this isn't looking like I want it to look. And when I had the part in the middle, it appeared that my left, your right, um, was longer. Is it just me? Or do you see that too? Now I will admit, I love the way it's cut. I love how it looks from the side. I love how it looks in the back. I love the way the wig is cut, but for some reason, I am having the hardest time making it look good with my face. Now 
Now right here, it actually started to look good in the middle, but I was like, maybe an off middle part. And then I was like, I don't know, maybe putting it behind my ear. See, yeah, that started to look better to me. General Savage. At ease, soldier. And ladies and gentlemen, we have a winner. So I'm just going to create a tiny baby hair right here. Just because you can see a little bit of my um, hairline peeping through. So I wanted to create a little bit of baby hair right here so it would mix in with um, my edges that are coming through where I slip down on the right side of the wig. And last but not least, let's go ahead and put some pressed powder right there in that part and make it a little bit more visible. You really don't need a whole lot, but because my cap is black, you can't see um, the part very well. So I had to use pressed powder because my wig cap is black. And okay, my darling, she is done being styled. Now I really do like her. I mean, all the way around from the each side, the back. I mean, the cut is lovely. The curls are nice. The texture is nice. This wig is a winner. All right, so that's it for today's video, you guys. I really hope that you all liked my new wig review. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you next time.